The Mandelbrot set is a fascinating mathematical object that reveals an infinite complexity and beauty when zoomed in. It is named after Benoit Mandelbrot, a pioneer of fractal geometry, who first visualized it in 1980. Beyond its mathematical significance, the form of the Mandelbrot set has been with us since long before its discovery in 1980. Either by esoterically communicated knowledge or by human intuition, our species has ascribed topics of major significance to and with the specific and exact shape and form of the Mandelbrot set from religions to national symbols and icons throughout our entire history worldwide. But it doesn't stop there. In recent times, computers and software have been developed to explore graphically the bewildering complexities of running a Mandelbrot set like it was a program itself in what are called Mandelbrot zooms. These dazzling displays are more than just nice to look at, they are demonstrations of something that takes a lot of computing to present. This item here is a single spire we've extracted from a Mandelbrot zoom. The same form can be observed in a plasma jet that is shot from the polar extreme of black hole M87. People have said that looks a bit like a tree with one deep root or a beautifully plumed snake with lots of feathers and a crown or a grail on its head. The ancient Egyptians may have been alluding to this with their symbolic bark, or boat, of a million years that their gods used to traverse the heavens when they patterned the aft section precisely with a fractal spire. It was this actual spire that was used to prompt an image-generating AI to mark out where on this is it that spacetime becomes variable, and this was the result. This exact graphic was taken to an animating AI which the prompted to show scenes likely to be experienced following this spacetime event signified on this fractal. As you can see the resultant animation was spectacular. Back to the science. The link between the Mandelbrot set and the wormhole was suggested by Leonard Susskind, a physicist who is one of the founders of string theory, a framework that attempts to unify all the forces of nature. Susskind proposed that the Mandelbrot set is a map of all the possible wormholes in the universe, and that each point in the set corresponds to a different wormhole configuration. According to Susskind, the shape of the Mandelbrot set reflects the geometry of the wormhole, and the colors of the set indicate the stability of the wormhole. The black region of the set represents the stable wormholes that do not collapse or radiate, while the colored region represents the unstable wormholes that either close up or emit energy. Susskind's idea is based on a conjecture called ER equals EPR, which states that two entangled particles, a quantum phenomenon where two particles share a mysterious connection that transcends space and time, are linked by a wormhole. This conjecture, which was proposed by Susskind and Juan Meldesena, Another string theorist, in 2013, is an attempt to reconcile quantum mechanics and general relativity, two theories that seem to contradict each other at the fundamental level. The ER equals EPR conjecture implies that the quantum world and the gravitational world are deeply connected, and that the Mandelbrot set is a manifestation of this connection. The ER equals EPR conjecture is still a speculative and controversial idea that has not been proven or tested experimentally. However, it offers a new perspective on the nature of reality and the possibility of exploring the universe through wormholes. The Mandelbrot set, which was once considered a mere mathematical curiosity, may turn out to be a key to unlocking the secrets of the cosmos. Thanks for watching.